Yes. All right, we're getting ready for Father's Day, a cocktail hour with the summer twist, Chicago based spirits and cocktail expert, Sarah Crossley, joining us with some whiskey cocktails that dad, many dads out there, will enjoy. So, welcome. It's a chock full of table of good times right here. So much good times. <laughs> Thanks for having me. A lot of truth serum on this table here. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, today we have um, two whiskeys. We've got Jefferson's Bourbon and we've got Chivas Regal uh, XV, okay. which is going to be the newest to the portfolio. Um, it's aged 15 years in cognac and oak barrels. Okay. Super smooth. Which makes a big difference. Yes, it does. So we're going to start with um, our Chivas cocktail, which okay. is going to be the Green Knight. So this is a scotch-based cocktail. Mm -hmm. We're going to do an ounce and a half of scotch. Okay. That's not bad. Don't drop it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I just wanted to make some noise okay. for you. <laughs> An ounce and a half of scotch. We're going to do one ounce of green tea. Whichever green tea you like, whatever you have available okay. to you will work. We're going to add some coconut rum. Today we're using Malibu, and we're going to do a quarter ounce of Malibu. Oh, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little flavor, right? Just to bring out the tropical notes. Okay. And we're going to do 0.75 ounces okay. of uh, lime juice. A little bit more. And then a little sweetener today, we're using agave. Okay. And so this is a perfect summer cocktail, so perfect for barbecues. Because it's refreshing, it's not that heavy. It's not heavy, and it's gonna bring out the smoothness of the scotch. Yeah. Um, it's gonna bring out the fruit forwardness. So that it's perfect for sipping summer barbecues and just delicious tropical cocktails. Now you mentioned like your dad's on the grill. I think the difference between mom's day and dad's day is moms don't want to cook. And on dad's day, dads want a barbecue. Absolutely. All right, so back in the backyard and you have a couple of those. So we're going to double strain this into a coop. And there you have it. The this green looks like, light. This looks like a shot glass at my house. <laughs> Cracking myself up. Thanks, Lourdes. <laughs> That's delicious. Nice tropical flavors. Thank you. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, I like it. So the next cocktail we're going to make is with the Jefferson's Bourbon. This is a father-son duo. It's been around for 25 years um, from Kentucky. Okay, of course. So perfect Father's Day gift. Exactly. With a story. I'm sure in the casks in the hills somewhere in Kentucky they store and uh, preserve that. And this one's super simple. So if you're not, um, a, you know, a person that makes cocktails at home every day, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this is a really great option because this one's really easy. Okay. We're going to do one ounce of Jefferson's bourbon, and you're going to build it directly into the glass. All right, so one shot of that. Yep. And then we're going to do Barrett's ginger beer. Oh, I like that. And this is called the horse feather. Huh. It's based off of a cocktail that was invented in the 1900s that used uh, ginger ale uh -huh. instead of ginger beer. And we're using ginger beer today. It's going to add a little bit more spiciness to it. And it's from Kentucky. So and it's horse from country. Kentucky. Yes. We're going to just take actually a little bit more ice here. Mm -hmm. Top it off. Stir it up. Give a little bit of a stir. And what do you have there? So this is Angostura. Okay. Yeah, it's bitters. And we're just going to top it off with three dashes of bitters. And that's just going to add some nice aromatics to it. I see. Um, give it some depth. More of an effervescent thing. Yes. And yeah. also just add some like spiciness to okay. it. Clove and things like that. And, uh, with a uh, lime. A little lime wedge. Top it off. And then this is going to be the horse feather. All right, very good. Cheers. Or they say in uh, Ireland, slancha. That's good. I really like that. I like it. To, I like the ginger beer element to it. It it's looks very like it's refreshing. Prob, not as many uh, ingredients as you said as this one right here. Absolutely. So, all right. So Father's Day, give it a try. Uh, we thank you so much for being here. I'll say cheers to you, Sarah. Cheers. Thank You're you awesome. for having me. Our day. You know, the hardest part about this segment is having to finish out the rest of the news. <laughs> you can check out more at Shivas.com and Jeffersonsbourbon.com. Thank you. We appreciate your time. We're going to have a little bit of a party. We'll be right back. All right.